of all the pieces of clothing to keep to give you incentive, it yeah. wouldn't be a bikini no. No. <laughs> for me. But I did, it did make me think, is it a good incentive? You know, if you've got that favourite piece of clothing. I had a pair of jeans that I had before I had Jack that I swore, you know, of course I'll get back into those. And I never have. And actually, I, every time we moved, those jeans were there and I was thinking, shall I just get rid of them? No, 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 I can still do this. And I did get rid of them the last time. We moved. They were a size 10 and I thought, I think my size but 10 days have gone. you can often get into a bikini even if you've got really fat because there are two <laughs> bits of material. <laughs> Let's be honest, you've got the pants, your the backside can in. hang out of the back, and then you've got the top part and there's this ghastly area in between. That's the bit I would not like. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I have... <laughs> there's nothing wrong with that. My top half wouldn't fit in the bikini. Well, we don't know which model of your top half. <laughs> I would get confused myself, but I know what you mean. I've got, like, jobbers and stuff. And, like, you want to keep, and, like, trousers. I'm, I'm a hoarder. I can't get rid of them, because I'm always like, right, I would definitely get in them. And when you try and put them on, I think, how on earth did I ever fit yes. in them? And then you lie on the floor, force the button That's up. That's right. And I know I'm not big, but you still see it over here. It's oh, yeah, that butt just moves around the back. Horrible. But it, it is that when you look at them, isn't it? And you go, I, did I really wear those? Yeah, yeah. Those but then you wear a baggy top and try and tuck it in to make you feel skinnier. Oh, we all do it. I've we? been so many different sizes. I've been a size 10, size 18. It yeah. goes up and down. I used to get rid of clothes. Now I keep them because I never know what well, size here we are. Many ages of living. That was obviously Birds of a Feather Days, 1989, yeah. 1990. That was probably not long ago, actually, that one. <laughs> and no, I'm not pregnant, I'm just fat in that one. <laughs> and this one's obviously a loose woman one, but, um, yeah, so I keep hold of everything now. But I have got a suit that I bought for um, David Seaman's wedding, so it was, like, a really posh wedding gaza and everyone was going to be there. So I went to this really posh shop and got it. It cost me really, really a lot of money. And I've still got it in the garage now. I'm never going to fit into it again, cos it was really... Oh. It was long and absolutely Are you beautiful. keeping it because it cost I'm you a lot of money? Cos it, cos it's like a work of art. It was all yeah. handmade and that. And it's absolutely lovely. I might have it framed one day. Because yeah. <laughs> it's never going to bit me. But, but did you feel fantastic? Oh, I in did. It? I felt absolutely well, then gorgeous. Well, it was worth every penny. Yeah, yeah. I wish I could find a picture. Aww.